This is Golden Eye Pinot Noir 2007 from the Gowan Creek Vineyard. Of course, Golden Eye is the Pinot Noir property that belongs to Duckhorn Vineyards. Duckhorn decided they wanted to make uh, a Pinot Noir that was as fabulous as their Merlot, and they knew they couldn't do that in their Napa Valley vineyards. So they found vineyards in the uh, Anderson Valley in Mendocino, which are in a much cooler climate, higher altitudes, and ideal for Pinot Noir. Um, the Gowan Creek Vineyard is the one that's uh, where, where the estate it actually is located, and it's sort of mid-valley. Southwest exposure. Uh, the vineyard itself actually has a lot of different sub-sites, and so they've actually planted different clones in the sub-sites within the vineyard that are, sort of, that are ideally suited to the soils and the different exposures that they're getting. And so even within this one vineyard, all these different blocks they come to ripeness at different times and they get and they pick them differently. Everything's vinified separately. They blend it all together in a very careful fashion. Come up with uh, the best wine they can they can create. Aged in uh, French oak, um, Allier, Vosges, Trancé, primarily new oak for 16 months. So, you know, you have this, um, these high altitude vineyards getting a lot of really great direct sunlight, but you have the cooling effects of the uh, ocean breezes and the fog coming up from the bottom of the valley, tempering that and, and giving these grapes a really nice, slow development. So they take on a lot of flavor and deliver a lot of flavor. I get a really pretty um, strawberry slash raspberry on the nose. And I also get some nice earthy tones like, uh, you know, sort of uh, forest, foresty tones. And something a little bit um, spicy, cedary. something really pretty. A um, little bit of licorice coming out, I think. Like an anise, star anise. Let's taste. Well, this wine comes across as incredibly lush, um, sort of sort of succulent. Really, just makes you want to drink it down. <laughs> um, I get a lot of uh, <clears throat> a lot more of that anise coming through with those strawberry sweet cherry notes, um, and the tannins are so supple they just kind of caress the inside of your mouth. Uh, just. Really nice. Um, I, uh, of course, decanted it, as you see, giving it a little breathing time. And I'm, I'm loving, loving what's coming out of here. Um, I would imagine that there's, there's certainly some nice concentration to this wine, some nice backbone. You could lay this down for a couple few years, but I doubt if I'd have the patience, frankly. <laughs> I'm going to want to drink this right now. And... Um, Probably could match it up with some uh, uh, heavier dishes. I would, I would love to try this with uh, sort of a, a roast loin of venison, something like that, something a little exotic. Enjoy.